Alrighty, so for whatever reason, many of you guys seem to want me to torture myself with some more SimCity. It didn't seem like Cities in Motion was the most popular game. Bit of, uh, well, there wasn't really consensus in what you guys wanted me to play. But, of course, we are continuing on with SimCity. I'm not even sure why people were thinking I'd quit or stopped or for whatever reason. Uh, but I love how EA have said that the servers and everything is fixed now. Look, it's saying that in Giovanni Woods we've only got 35,000 people. Whereas over here, it hasn't even updated in Tosca Cliffs, and we've been playing in Tosca Cliffs for ages, and it doesn't seem to be able to like ping the servers with the correct information and get it back. But what I'm going to do is just quickly search out just oh, some barren lands. Not really sure where I should go. Everything here seems pretty good. It's, uh, I guess, every little bit of land is quite useful in terms of well resources. Let's see. No, alright, I'll just settle with this then. I'll go ahead and claim it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a city. I'll call it Pyongyang. It will have only residential and just the most basic of necessities. Let's go and play that. Traviata Knoll. Now, Traviata Knoll will be very, very useful. What I'll do is once we've got this set up and loaded, I think I'll just uh, set up with the original money that we've got. I'll take out the $100,000 loans. And then we'll head over to Tosca Cliffs real quick, send over the money, and we'll be back to Treviata Knoll trying to work out magic. And uh, what I'll do, the goal I'm trying to have over here is what I was thinking of maybe even starting up a new Let's Play, but what I'll do is I'll probably just use this city. I'll try to do like a one road challenge where we only have one road, and uh, that's it for the whole city. So, first of all, let's go out. Alright, we can't even take our bonds, right? Okay. Now, I'm not sure what we should go for. Should we go for high-density streets or avenues? I'm thinking, to be honest, probably avenues. And what I'll do is, well, they'll need to be upgraded. I won't want to waste too much money at the moment. So I just want one massive curb. This will be better. What's that? That's arc roads, isn't it? And this is curved. Right, we want curvy roads. Something like so. Actually, should I make it straight or should I not? Like, curvy, but straight. I'm sure you guys with OCD are... No. Alright, what I'll do is I'll just create a curve. What if I... Oh, so confusing. What should I go for? Alright, this is what I'll do. I'll go for a road like that and I'll just straighten it out. Uh, something like that. And then we'll go ahead go back to arc roads. Uh, but firstly, let's just take out loans so we don't have any problems. Department of Finance in the region. Ooh, this is interesting. So we aren't able to take out the maximum loans? Okay. It's interesting how the game sees a region because, I mean, over here, I'm, well, I'm, sh well I'm, I know, I know for certain that we do have the maximum amount of uh, finance upgrades because we can take out hundred thousand dollar loans which is very interesting but there we go okay so maybe just updating the things now god damn EA and their damned server-side simulations nope either it hasn't realized it or it just won't work uh, it remains to be seen I do want to take out some massive loans though but I guess I'll have to donate a good half a million dollars or so Anyway, back to roads, and uh, go back to an arc road, there we go, seems like it'll all work out very well, and see, I don't want any intersections apart, well, that's not really an intersection either, so it should be all smooth sailing, I'll just go ahead and uh, create a straight road, what I'll do is I'll face the camera around this way, there we go, so it's a bit more palatable, that away. Alright, and we've got to twist it around, and I'll leave it for now, then we've got to check like where the water is and all of that stuff. Beautiful. I can see this uh, city being quite good, because it won't have any traffic problems. I think we can be guaranteed of that. Okay, now that's a lot of money. Let's go take out one bond. $50,000 if it has to come to that. Alright, so now electricity let's just go with coal power just so we can of course check out 
which way the pollution is blowing. Okay, so it's, well, okay, that's all right. Or I could go for the solar power plants as well. Nuclear, not so much, because the people aren't educated over here. And, uh, well, I don't think I'll be placing a bus system. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. And let's check out water. Okay. Right. Okay. Uh, but, of course, once we'll have a lot of money, firstly what I'll do is just, I guess, uh, houses. And that's all we're going to be building over here, housing. And by that I mean a heck of a lot of it. Do this side, okay. You know what, I can speed things up a little. Uh, cheater mode, still not activated. I'll leave it at that, so I won't be making too many comments. Now, uh, let's get out of here. Maybe we could just wait up for a couple of houses to be built. I wonder why the houses are built like furthest away. It's always interesting, it's always, uh, I don't know, caught my attention to say the least. Unlock the solar farm, thank you very much, although the solar farm to me is one of the most underpowered great buildings that you can get. Okay, that's good enough. Now, let's head over back to region view, and we want to head over to Tosca Cliffs. Loads, seems like they need alloys. I'm pretty sure I told Tosca Cliffs to also import alloys, so it'll be interesting to see how all that works, uh, but uh, also there was an update, it was very weirded out at the fact that the server had to download an update kind of weird because I didn't read anything about it on reddit or anything or any sites uh, but on reddit uh, there's been a bit of censorship to say the least uh, they've been censoring like posts because it pretty much became a big circle jerk about EA negativity uh, but the negativity to me was uh, much deserved because the game is as you guys know we'll leave it at that uh, but now, what I want to do is, some people still don't realize that, even though it says we're losing money here, how do you think I'm making much, so much money? I don't think some people understand, uh, but we have a neighboring mayor visits. Sh shouldn't it be from that city over here? Or unless he's somewhere else. No, hopefully that's saved. Because it should be coming up from here. Unless is that far away. Anyway, uh, we should get to business. Now, what I've got to do is go to region view. Ah, oh, there it is. Now, that's Tudor Isle. Traviata Knoll. Doesn't seem like it's remembered anything. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. All right. <laughs> so, we'll see how it work. Uh, no, I actually don't want to work on this, but we're sending alloys here. And I told them to send uh, TV crates as well. Uh, so, it'd be interesting to see how it'll all work out. I think I'll just send over $400,000 to... Uh, let's get out of here, and we want to look at you. Gift. Okay, I should be able to gift money. You know what, I'll set it to max. Ooh, interesting. Why is the maximum amount only $130,000? Who knows? Gift in progress. Ah, really? I know what's happening. Unless it's the guy... Okay, this must... Ah, I see what's happening. Because as I said, like last episode, I told a guy to go ahead and gift me some uh, money. And I had no idea like what he was doing. He seemed to have just been bludging about. Because uh, it's taken like a good hour or so of playing and nothing has been transferred to other cities. So I was really worried uh, that they might have stolen my money and I'll never see it again. Uh, in the meantime, I've also deleted uh, these intersections. So hopefully traffic will be a bit smoother. It seems like it has fixed itself up at least further on here. But now we've got problems here and I've created a lot of these uh, spaghetti roads, I guess you could call them. It's a lot of traffic though, out and about, and uh, it's interesting what the hell they're trying to do. Because look, this line, or traffic jam, I guess is all... Because they are on the right hand side of the road, so they are trying to turn right. Why can't they just come up out, out over here? I will never know. They'll come down here, and I bet you like most of these guys are going to be coming up the tunnel. 
Oh no, these guys are actually going up here. Other direction. I love my new house. Well, that's a good thing to hear. Oh. We've got poor infested waters here. Very nice indeed. Hope we won't run into too many problems, although might have to go ahead and upgrade that soon. Damn, I don't want to delete those big buildings. They look nice. So I'm not sure where I should place this because this needs to be connected like all together. Overlapping, you say. It's the only place we can do it and it ain't gonna work. So anyway. Now this traffic jam is cleared up, so what if I go over to here and go to the gifting, okay. So it looks like the guy's coming into Tosca Cliffs, he should be going out. It's one of these vehicles, there, that's where he is. Aha, uh -huh, he's getting, okay. I see what he's doing, he still hasn't taken the money out. And I'm guessing he's going to come all the way. So what's happening is what they've done is... I don't really like it what they've done, but uh, the Simulion delivery truck, Simulion delivery truck, is I guess going to come to the town hall, and that's where it takes its money, and then it drives off to another city. Uh, so I guess it is also quite dependent on traffic, which is a bit sad and unfortunate. But hopefully we are making money. Let's check out what are our expenses on alloys, alloys. Okay. I'm expecting plastics to be up here as well. Let's check out the plastic plant, the recycling plant at least. It still has lots of goods or stuff to recycle, so that's okay with me. Now, where is this truck? Can I spot it? It's not here. Is it still over here? Nope. That's just a white van. A seedy white van at that. That's where it is. Oi. No. No, come back. Yes. That's him. Yeah, so he is like the uh, delivery truck. Delivery guy. Who's trying to take the money. Uh, where is he going? He's going to come down here. What the hell are you doing? You're putting your rubbish. You missed that bottle. God, there's all rubbish coming from behind. Now, what are these guys waiting on? It's one bastard that's trying to push in. What an asshole. Why are you not honking at him? There we go. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> uh, where is the delivery truck now? Hopefully, it's gone a lot further on. And we've missed it. Seems like it has. That's some police. I uh, wouldn't mind checking out crimes committed a day. It's not too bad. Four crimes a day. There's a robber there. But we have fairly decent police coverage, especially with all these cars, etc. This smelting plant is creating so much problems, at least with the ground pollution. What's this flashing red? Running on battery power. I don't think we have any power problems, though, do we? I don't think so, anyway. Uh, coal... Okay, unfortunately I can't place another garage there. It's not letting me for whatever reason. Uh, so we can go ahead and deliver the coal away from me quicker. Look, it's already 20 out of 20 coal. But for whatever reason, I can't do it anywhere. Place a garage anywhere, which makes me quite sad. I would love to export coal a bit quicker. But now... Okay, we're at $807,000. So hopefully any time now... We'll be getting a nice delivery, or at least uh, giving our money away. Let's check this out. So where is the car now? Oh god, it's still up there. Oh, there it is. Jeez, you're definitely taking your time. And I guess he's going to be turning left now. Yep. To his left, anyway. And okay, you're going to be hopefully going down this way. Hopefully where there's not going to be too much traffic. Nobody likes traffic. It's a bit dangerous how they have to funnel in from three 
<laughs> lanes into one. Or two, sorry. Definitely don't like roads like that, especially when I was uh, on my driver's license, learning how to drive, especially roundabouts as well. I hate roundabouts. <laughs> Cannot drive through dry roundabouts at all. What's a removalist truck as well? Whoa, I don't care about you. Now, I don't think we can look at the electronics monthly transaction reports. Like these reports, um, you can't really look through them. It's just like a thing, really. Can't look at trading as well. Hopefully this guy's somewhere here. Nope, nowhere to be seen there. It's taking the damn delivery truck a long time. He's a damn impertinence. Okay, he's there. Not long to go now. Uh, well, I guess... Where's this traffic going? It's going this way to the left. That's not too bad. Seems like it's all running smoothly up north and away from the city, but uh, to the city, at least to the houses, it's a bit of an issue. Uh, that's why I put all these roads around here, so people have lots and lots of options to drive. Uh, maybe I'll need to upgrade this roads right over here. Yep. Okay, that should help things out, run a bit smoother. Apart from that, like, almost every road is upgraded uh, to the highest amount that it can be. Yeah, everything's pretty well upgraded. So I'm thinking, how else could I cut down on traffic time? Especially, well, mainly over here on this central road or avenue. I'm not really sure where are they all going. They're coming over to the left. Hmm, it's very interesting. Whatever they're doing. Because they're all trying to funnel themselves out into one lane. That's the issue. And then what? Uh, so what's, what's just happened is that this building is uh, filled up now with people, so now they're going to the next house that's open and nearest to them. So I guess maybe these houses. Because all the cars are going to end up following each other. Oh, I can hear crime. Someone's got a damned AK. What the hell is that? Here? Is that where the crime's happening? Where's the crime? Oh, it was over here. Is the criminal getting away? He's in a car. Oh no. Committed crime returning to his high hut. Came from Adopter Rat. I have no idea where Adopter Rat is. Nor do I really care. What I really care about is what this damned car is doing that's... Uh, Supposed to be taking all my money. Where is he? He's still probably stuck in the same spot, isn't he? Yep. What is he ever here for? Okay. <laughs> I'm not sure why it's taking him so long. He should have... Like, there's all these other delivery trucks that can get to here and... What is he doing? He was like right over here before, wasn't he? He just had to turn one little section of road. Okay. Um. Okay. What is he doing? Now I do know there are a couple of glitches with the uh, delivery truck. Well, uh, sorry, I want to follow you. So I just set him on to follow. I'd just rather look at the whole city and all its magnific magnificence and uh, the Giovanni Woods as well. I'm just not sure what he's trying to do. Uh, there's a glitch where which uh, there's a delivery truck that spawns every couple of hours uh, coming into a city and then he just uh, doesn't take money away but he keeps on giving you money so that's a positive, well it's like a cheat. 
Uh, but it's still pretty good. I'm not sure what this guy is doing though. Because he doesn't have any money carrying with him. And uh, he definitely does have more than enough. I think I only selected to send in like $300,000 or so. Because I don't think one crate is a million dollars or a thousand dollars or whatever. Definitely not. I'm just not sure what he's trying to do. And now he's out of the city. Very weird. Alright, well, two to lead to you. I guess he's going up right over here. Alright, well, I guess it's time to check back up on the city. There's still so many of these issues here. Unskilled workers, unskilled. Alright. So the way, another way that I think you can get rid of unskilled workers is, well, not not only by building up your own education system, which doesn't seem to be helping us out all too much. We've closed this. Was, I don't think it was necessary. I wanted to, uh, this over here so we could at least be within a good range of both the TV processor factory as well as the processor factory. And like, it doesn't seem like I have any problems with money. We've made about $500,000 before uh, the start of the episode. Um, hmm. Quite an issue, this. I'm not sure what's happening with the money. Who knows? Uh, but what I'd like to do is, because I've got the money, I'd like to go ahead and uh, build a bus terminal. We've already built a double-decker bus terminal, so let's just go with the normal bus terminal. And find a good spot to place it which is almost non-existent <laughs> yeah there's no one here here we go so we've sent the money to Giovanni Woods although the truck wasn't carrying any simulian gifts though I've got no idea how it works it's uh, so damn confusing let's check it out then uh, region view load because I needed money in Giovanni Woods, that's why I've sent it there. I wonder how much it was. I don't think it was very much at all. And it doesn't seem like my um, financial status in Tosca Cliffs has gone down from that truck. So who knows? But then again, when you gift, they take away money away from you right away, though, don't they? Pretty sure they do. Okay, very nice. We've got money. And the reason I sent uh, the money gift over here is that so we can send it over to Tudor Isle, where our casinos are, uh, because Tosca Cliffs and Tudor Isle, of course, aren't connected any in any way, shape, or form. Okay. I've arrived for a tour. Okay, I'm not really sure about that myself. Or maybe if I sp had to have sped things up in Tosca Cliffs, it would have been better, but I'm so out of it with speeding things up, because still, no cheater mode. And it's just a completely different game without cheater mode, really. It's more of a uh, sit and wait type of play style. Instead of, of course, I do like to have a goal in mind, achieve that goal, and then slow things down, make sure we're making money and everything's working how it should be, and then go back to speeding things up. Wow, we are making a lot of money now. I guess it's through taxes. Taxes aren't that high or bad either. Check out if I can... There we go. So it was $500,000. That's nice. Uh, so now what I could do is... Because we are trying to buy all these epic things from Tudor Isle. Seems like we are connected to it in one way or another. Probably rail. Uh, so what I'll do... Gift... There we go. I'll send a gift of... Ah, I do like how if you keep on clicking, it goes up by like 50s. $350,000 sounds good. Fantastic. So let's keep playing. Make sure the uh, delivery truck comes out and about. Takes our money. Okay, it seems like it already has. That was weird. So how about I try to go over in Tudor Isle? So I was trying to build Pyongyang, and clearly it hasn't come about uh, this episode, but that's what we'll be doing. I'll probably go ahead and just uh, do a little bit more of this by myself. 
and uh, just make sure I've uh, put all the money to some slush funds into the Pyongyang city and uh, I'll go ahead and get to work on that in the next episode but at the moment I wouldn't mind seeing this I don't want to build any great works although I'm guessing like an international airport will help us out a lot as well as the space center as well brings about tourists but what I'm more keen on I don't know how it's going to come here, but let's keep playing here. Check out what the problem is. And we are going to be losing over here so quickly. <laughs> God damn. Alright, that's why I sent money over here, isn't it? I'm going to have to tax the people through the roof, or better yet... Uh, oh God, here we go. It's about, they're about to hit us right now. Oh. Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh that's funny stuff. We just got the money sent to us just then bloody beautiful I was gonna say we're gonna go bankrupt over here that is bloody beautiful that is a sight to behold all right now these casinos do make us lose a lot of money um, I'm not sure if Max has patched it yet I'm pretty sure they haven't I haven't read anything it's all that um, French guy Gulim or whatever his name is that's uh, been pretty much the uh, guy to blame uh, he's been answering all the questions that people have on Twitter about all, all these patches etc. Can't connect bridges. Okay. If I do something like that, that won't work. This will. Okay. Of course I don't want too many intersections. Uh, but this will enable me to expand on this island a little bit more as well. Police. God damn. God damn it. What the hell has happened over here? It's like 9-11. Let's go ahead and just save some injured people so I can get some more renown and then we'll be able to upgrade Maxis Manor and that'll all be nice. Do I have a police precinct? I should. Police station. Well, fancy that. There, okay, there we go. I was going to say, we do have a police precinct. It looks like we might hit the max amount of jail cells so might have to get a couple of them let's just build more patrol cars though so they can all spam each other even at that little bit extra build a couple of jail cells out back oh nice we can keep on piling him up up on top you know what i might as well get a helipad i don't think it's going to make too much i'll place it over so when the criminals are sleeping and the uh, police helicopter has to come up above It'll all wake him up. How's that for an idea? There's a helicopter. That's at least nice. Costs a lot of money though. And crime prevention sensor. That sounds good. Quite smart. Alright, it all has to be connected up. And I guess we've run out of space. Then next up we can build a detective wing. If we have a university with School of Law in the region. It's still going to take us a little while. But now, there we go. Let's see what they're all doing. They're coming in and out. Very productive. I guess the donuts must have come off sale and They realised they were on sale and then they were off sale. Typical. Fire's blazing out of control. Police are all coming over to one criminal. What's this guy doing? Damn, it looks like the police have caused the crashes themselves. <laughs> that was happened over here. This guy is literally causing all the problems. Quite literally. What's, who's that? Is that some guy on a motorbike? It is. On a little scooter. What the hell has happened? So the, you, you can never be sure of what's wrong with this city. Like if it's the traffic especially because... Yeah, I've got no idea what's happening now. Like, they're literally all stuck. This lane is completely clean. But no! They've all got to procrastinate. Anyway, we've got to get out of here and try to keep on making a little bit more money. Because at the moment, we're losing lots and lots of money. No profits. Wow. Wow, what, what's been going on? We should be getting lots and lots of tourists. Let's check out over here. 
gambling, we're losing money. Uh, but if we go, maybe I should bring in a draw card. That's what I should get. Expo Center. What do we need for this? Department of Tourism in the region. I don't have a Department of Tourism. That's a bit embarrassing. I'm pretty sure I had one. Clearly not. Department of Tourism. Let's just put it right behind. There we go. That looks good. So now, uh, what I'm pretty sure you can do is uh, either you can get either. Well, there's three types of buildings that you can get that I think only came in the deluxe edition, which thankfully I've got. I uh, think like the Big Ben, the Arc, Arc de Triomphe. Clearly, my French accent isn't there in my French voice. Uh, and uh, the Brandenburg Gate, or something of the sort, uh, enables. Uh, well, German houses to be built, or German themed and styled buildings, and then uh, London or English style buildings and then French style buildings as well. That's quite a weird looking house. Uh, after all, it is burnt down. Why do you not want to demolish yourself? Okay. Uh, so, I think we should get out of here pretty quickly, uh, but what I'll do is I'll donate another couple probably a million dollars or so and I'll go ahead and we'll do the Pyongyang city which is something that we've got to do but we've also got to uh, get more tourists into here and the way we do that is by building cultural buildings as well as maybe a pro stadium although god damn that thing is massive is it even gonna fit in here yeah it will I only just we would have to like get rid of a road or two might have to like squeeze it in here somewhere it'd be interesting to see how that'll work <laughs> but I'm very much looking forward to that. I might have to demolish a couple of these commercial buildings. Maybe that would be smart. Uh, but until next time, guys, hopefully you are enjoying it. Of course, SimCity will always be continuing on. I could imagine doing a lot of episodes with it. Uh, and, well, yeah. I guess Cities in Motion will also continue, as well as some of the other games uh, that will be coming out sooner rather than later. But until next time, I'll see you all later.